I'm thinking we're in Ohio. Hey, good job, Dad. He's gonna end it, look at that. Stevan's trying to figure out the parking situation here in downtown Cleveland. Because we're locked out. Did it work? Hold on, no, it didn't. Let me see. In LA, here we come. No way, really? No. There we go. Yep. Look at this place. Yep, watch out for this guy. There we go. Alright. Alright. Daily. Park. There we go. I think we're I think we're Overnight, actually figuring it baby. out. Cheaper than hey, we don't have to valet anything. No, dude. We're yeah. our own valets. Listen. At least this time. We'll have valet one day. Like, 24-7 <laughs> valet. I can fit here? Yeah, you totally fit here. Definitely just... We might have to, like, 10-point turn. 10-point <laughs> turn in this huge Lincoln. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. Alright, hold on. Do we just keep going? Yeah. Do we just I, keep I don't going? like parking anyways. Like, even my car next to, like, the no, I'm with you. you. All right, let's keep right. going. Let's go to where there's a flashing light down there. Yeah. That is like, that's some saw type. <laughs> it really is. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we found parking. We got in. We're good to go, baby. Now we just need to get a hotel. Now we get in the hotel. Hey, this is behind the scenes. <laughs> <laughs> we just need putting in grills. What does this uh, elevator shaft smell like? I'm thinking we're in Ohio. <laughs> you guys can't smell it, but maybe you can just feel the Ohio aura coming through the screen. Listen. Two words. Skibbity toilet. <laughs> Made a quick, uh, we're doing a quick trip to Cleveland this weekend. Um, got some uh, business matters to attend to tomorrow for, uh, for our brand that uh, is releasing, uh, hopefully by the end of the month, called Onev. Uh, but tonight, we're going to uh, Beat the Streets Cleveland uh, to watch some wrestling. There's gonna be some events. Keep going straight, I One think, more. yeah. One more. We're going to, uh, we're gonna watch some events or some matches tonight for Be the Streets Cleveland and uh, uh, cheer on and support some guys. My friend uh, Daniel DeShazer, Dap, he's wrestling tonight, and then uh, Caden Henschel's wrestling Muggsy Bulljunk. So I'm gonna uh, cheer them on as well. So it's cool just because you know there really hasn't been much wrestling stuff going on these uh, past couple months. Um, so I think it'll be pretty cool to just like go and go and show my support to the wrestling community and. Um, watch the matches, you know, I'm kind of fiending for some wrestling, so it's kind of cool. It's going to be, be exciting. Two queens, please. We're staring at one right now. He doesn't play. <laughs> this is what happens when you flirt with the front desk lady, she gives you a penthouse view of the beautiful Midwestern city, Cleveland, Ohio. This is a cool church. Gotta roll up with a Gojo shades on. If you know, you know. I don't even know what shades these are. I don't know, but it's nice to be recording you who's recording me. <laughs> What always came first, the chicken or the egg? <laughs> <laughs> I got the call up for coaching position. Yes, yeah, we are very good. Yaki, how are you? How are you? How are you doing? I'm good, I'm good. Hey, good to see you. Yeah, one time champ. But his brother is a, also an NCAA champion. He's, um, yeah, anyways, we're doing, uh, I'm, came, I'm coming here to coach one of the wrestlers and oh, you watch. Are? Yeah. 
Uh, also, Mike Curley told me to say hi. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dude, it's pumped to see you here. Yeah, this is yeah, sick. Yeah, yeah. I was supposed to be wrestling. Yeah, dude, I was like, I thought I you were going to wrestle. I was at the trials and yeah, the what suplex happened? and sometimes when you Listen, that happens do all good the time. moves, you, like you, you do good, yeah, like you, you get hurt, hurt yourself doing the move and it's like whoa <laughs> I, I thought this was a good thing yeah so well you're yeah. looking good man technique you know i mean likewise yeah. likewise salute it, salute yeah, yeah. so they didn't start the matches yet no we're supposed to be starting any minute yo i think it's late what up Boy. That's this my boy man? right here <laughs> this is him. Was coming i hey i made the trip hey. for you <laughs> <laughs> No, I got some own I got some stuff to do tomorrow in yeah. Akron, so nice. we, may, we maybe pulled up. Okay, and I got us some more of my boys. Do you even have to weigh in? No. No. <laughs> Fuck no. And he looks big as shit. <laughs> We're gonna do what we gotta do. We're, uh, We're you're funny. Yeah. How you doing, baby? I'm good, bro. Good to see you. Nice to meet yeah. you, fish. How, How are you? Yeah, man. You look good, though. <laughs> Thanks, man. Hey, oh, yeah, man. What did you get in? Uh, I just drove in. I got some business stuff to take care of tomorrow, and I can't be supported. Yeah, I'm actually co I'm coaching against you tonight. <laughs> Watch out, bro. No, I'm kidding. Yeah. No, I mean, it's going to be fun, man. I know, they, I can't wait. They fucking put the rules away to a degree because it's the What do they make you do? Like, like, he can't, we can't have a point system because it's the way he can't get it. Is it still free? Is it freestyle or no? It, it's folk style. Because it it, everything else is freestyle, right? Yeah. Okay. So six, it's two, 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 so six okay. minutes and no points. See if we push out, things like that. No yeah, point system at all. I don't want to fuck up a chance for college next season, bro. I get you. Just have fun tonight, man. It's going to be sick. Bring the crowd, you know what I mean? That's what it's about. Grow wrestling yeah. bigger. Yeah. And you're going to get that attention. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, man. It's going to be dope. It'll, it'll be a good time at this point. You know, we won't be like as serious as I made mean, at first. Yeah. <laughs> Only because of this definitely kind of putting it, put it two yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what I feel, man. So, hey, man, you looking good. Thanks. It's a privilege to meet you, bro. Of course, bro. Of course. Do you have to do something. Yeah, let's do something. Good. Mike, what's it going? What's up, of course I got to come and support. Well, guess what? what? Yesterday, I well, you know, I didn't know I was competing. Like, yeah. I, I drove my parent, my dad, and my brother back because he was giving me my partner. I'm like, guys, I'm not going to wrestle. You don't want to sit there like, yeah, whatever. We start driving three hours later. Hey, Caden, you can do it, but there's so many stipulations you have to do. Really? Like, it is just, there's no scoring. Like, you can't have a score on a scoreboard, but we still wrestle. So everyone can keep track in their heads, but you just can't put it up, and it can't be seen as a match that scores what, what's the difference of like this compared to like if you did like a post is it because it's preseason technically yeah, and like I you're think, in season I think there's a reason that's because it's within like the certain range like that's why like the all-star classic is out of that preseason but there's still like another rule that's like if it was like a celebrity matchup and that's that's why it can work with like only to boost YouTube if it was oh, a match so it's more okay. of like like a, a bit in a vlog let's yeah. say than an actual thing because usually like Beat the Streets does something right like where it's like oh I can do I can go ahead and uh, wrestle like a freestyle match and get it like after the season's over and it can have like I think Jesse Jesse Mendez yeah. wrestled uh, what's his name Alirez like last I was like that's kind of yeah. weird that was a Beat the Streets event that's true so you know what I mean where it, if, I but I th it must be because it's in within the time period. Yeah, it must. It was that makes like, the most sense. And the thing was, the worst thing is like we've known five months out, but now it becomes a problem. Of course, like, classic. Yeah, <laughs> it's classic, buddy. No, what's, what's up? What's some last words of advice? Last words of advice. All right, we got as, um, as my official wrestling. I'm official for the coaching day. him today. Um, good position. Sir. Just uh, you know, be calm. You know what you do as soon as you shake hands. You gotta just stay calm. Don't let anything like phase you. You know what I mean? Just because of the hype. Just because yeah. of the, that's that's the main thing. Like and big throws. Like come on, that's that's first things first. You know that's coming, yeah. right? Yeah. You know the big throws are coming. <laughs> so you keep stay out of them. I think you'll be all right. They, your good instincts will take over. That's all go, I got for my boy. <laughs> <laughs> Appreciate that. That's awesome. Of course. Of course. Yeah. No. Thanks so much for coming. This is great. Staging area. Sweating already. Ninja 50 to the bullpen. <laughs> that was me. <laughs> Novice 60. With your weight on your, drawn on your arm? Yeah, <laughs> like a nice little weekend tat coming in. <laughs> First impression, seven. Wow, it's actually pretty cool in here. The event's awesome. It looks, it looks great, actually. This is cool. You can have, like, dinner and stuff, and, like, have, like, a little, little, like, Sit right on the mats, like the wrestling's happening right there. That's pretty sick. I think like we need to kind of go into the direction of having more like matches and stuff for uh, for the sport, like one off, like you know, kind of like fight card type style. I think that just would be a lot more beneficial for the sport and draw a lot more attention weekly or not weekly, but draw more attention. You know, you can kind of follow athletes a little bit more, have events, and kind of hype it up. So uh, 
you know, it's hard, it's hard to follow a tournament and just having one match against, you know, highly ranked people and, you know, kind of build off of that. That'd be kind of a cool concept to go, go going forward from like the professional scene of things. Finished up cornering Caden against Muggsy. Stevan, how was the day overall? Dude, overall, amazing day. I mean, just for something like so quick and like, you know, we were able to make this drive out to do this uh, is awesome. I mean, I had a great time. Um, it's just cool to support wrestling at all, at all levels, all divisions. Um, having events like this and cards 
Beat the Streets is awesome. They, they have a great, uh, what Beat the Streets does for, uh, you know, fundraising. It's an cha uh, awesome charity that they're doing uh, to get kids off the streets into wrestling. I mean, that's, first of all, amazing that they can put things like this together, you know, having events like this, um, doing it in other cities too, like Cleveland, uh, put together a great event. And, yeah, I don't know, I think it was cool just having the uh, overall atmosphere, having a lot of good wrestlers in there watching, you know, uh, old, young, and then uh, you know, ending the ending the show with uh, with a cool little influencer match. So it was nice. And I got it was cool to co coach Kate. I'm thankful that he let me do that. And really awesome what Muggsy can do too. From you know, both awesome guys, and hope they can grow the sport. So let's go, baby. If you like this content, make sure to like the video, subscribe to our channel. We got more posts, more videos coming out weekly. Uh, world champs and everything we do, baby. Let's go.